Welcome back guys to another what I ate today video. This one is very special because it is a collab video with one of my favorite food channels, Lauren Toyota. Her channel is amazing for great food ideas. She actually has two different food channels her channel with lauren toyota and hot for food i get so many of my vegan recipes from both her channels so i'm so excited to be doing this collab with her today you guys are gonna love the recipes that she does in her video and we have really different styles you guys know that i like to keep my food pretty quick and easy and lauren is a true cook so you're gonna get two different styles from both our videos so make sure as soon as you're done watching mine you go check out hers and it's gonna give you guys tons of healthy vegan food inspiration i started off my day with my favorite smoothie my power smoothie i love this smoothie because you don't need a lot to go in it I basically kind of throw in whatever fruits I have on hand. So today I had a couple of really nice ripe bananas, some pineapples, some strawberries, and then my favorite vegan protein. This is a Sun Warrior Wario blend, and I love throwing it into my smoothies. It tastes great, and it gives me that kick of protein that I need to start my day. And I'm so excited to share with you guys that I've updated my blender from the Nutribullet to the Ninja, and this thing is a beast. I definitely recommend it if you're looking for a great blender. This thing is a powerhouse. So I smooth it all up and it tastes absolutely delicious. I love starting my day with this. All throughout the day, I love to snack. I like to eat all day long. So whether it's a bowl of grapes or a bowl of cut up veggies like cucumbers and snap peas or just any fresh fruit that I have on hand, I like to snack throughout the day in between my meals to keep my energy going. So for lunch, I had I was kind of in a hurry for lunch. I didn't have a lot of time, so I decided to do this rice noodle soup bowl which is all vegan and it's super quick and easy to make. I really like going to my local grocery store and finding some quick, easy vegan options. There will always be those days when you just don't have a lot of time. So having something on hand like this can be really helpful. And I don't like to use the entire packet of seasoning. I only use a tiny, tiny bit so the sodium isn't too high. And then I put everything in a bowl. You can always add your own veggies in this if you like as well with uh, just a few side crackers. And that was pretty much what I had for lunch. I had a couple fruit snacks after that and then it was time for dinner. I decided to make french fries, potatoes. So first thing up is to preheat the oven to 450 degrees. And I grabbed two large potatoes and I just cut them up lengthwise because I wanted to make that kind of potato shape. So um, you can use as many potatoes as you want. I think one potato per person is perfect. And I just cut them all up. And then I added my favorite seasoning. So I added a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of organic oregano, and some salt and pepper. But of course you could do whatever you want if you like a little bit of paprika, garlic powder, it's really up to you. So season the fries however you want. And then I just mix it all together to get the seasoning all over the fries. And then I laid it all out on a baking sheet. Make sure that you leave enough room between all the fries so they don't kind of like stick together and they cook properly and then stick it in the oven for about 20 25 minutes or basically until they get crispy <laughs> and then beside the fries i decided to make one of my favorite favorite meals for dinner just a huge jumbo salad using some of my favorite veggies and beans for this i decided to use a spring mix for the base added some cucumbers, added some tomatoes, added some mushrooms, corn, black beans. And I like to use a really, really big bowl so I can get as much salad in there as possible. And I also added a bit of avocado. And today I'm gonna to be showing you guys one of my favorite dressing recipes, a balsamic vinaigrette made from scratch. And I actually got this recipe off of Hot For Food. So thank you for that, Lauren. <laughs> I make this all the time. You only need a few ingredients. So first up, I have a little bit of olive oil, some balsamic vinegar, 
Dijon mustard, garlic powder, a little bit of coconut sugar, salt, and pepper. Mix it all up and it makes the most delicious, healthy dressing. I decided to add a bit of almonds on the salad and some dried cranberries. I love adding seeds and dried fruit to salads as well. And then I plated everything. The fries were perfectly crisp and then I piled on tons of salad. This is one of my favorite meals for dinner because it's so satisfying and filling but it doesn't make you feel uncomfortable before bed. I drizzled a little bit of the dressing then I kept the rest on the side so I could have some of the salad later. And that is pretty much it for my what I ate today video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure you go check out Lauren's channel and her video. You guys are going to love it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave me a comment, and I'll see you guys again in another video very soon.